completely forgot to vlog because I was booking uh, flight tickets to Good morning or good afternoon. It is 12.30 and I actually woke up at 6. I did yoga and then I went back to bed at 9. And I slept until 11. And I did email and stuff like that. And right now I'm going to have breakfast. Though I completely forgot to vlog because I was booking uh, flight tickets to Spain. I uh, already told you about the travel plans to Germany yesterday. So when you're watching this, Tomorrow, we will be leaving to Baden-Württemberg. After that, I haven't told you this one either, but we will, uh, we will be going to London. So right after I come back, I come back on Sunday, and then we leave again on Thursday and Friday to London. That's gonna be like the craziest trip. Well, the craziest trip. It's, it's a business trip, but it's gonna be so much fun. And I hope I can tell you more about it uh, when we arrive there because I'm not sure if I'm supposed to tell about it, what it's for and yada yada yada. By the way, I just watched a Jenna Marbles video and she announced she's going to be in London for the upcoming two weeks. Now, I am going to be there on the last two days that she's there too. So I am just madly madly hoping to run into Jenna that would be insane like Jenna is one of my favorite youtubers that would be loco dude so uh, after that you might be interested we will be going to Spain at the beginning of September south of Spain and after that there might be another trip but it's not yet confirmed so I'm a little bit you know afraid that I will jinx it if I tell you where we would be going but it's also in Europe and then there's a crazy trip coming up it's a far away trip to South America I'm not gonna tell you which country either because that ticket hasn't been booked yet and also, but it's like 80-90% sure that one will happen, but I'm still like, uh, I don't want to jinx it, so I don't want to tell it. And then after that, I'm working on uh, India. I think it's going to be the beginning of October, so probably like the 7th or the 8th of October, we will be flying to Mumbai uh, until the beginning of December, I think. So those are the travel plans for the upcoming months and then i don't know what 2017 will bring because 2016 was freaking off the chain in terms of travel and i don't know i'm i'm freaking excited to be doing these travel plans and we will see in 2017 where do you think we should go like put your ideas down below where would you like to go you can pick anywhere in the world except antarctica or other cold places i would you know where i would really like to go wait i will just grab some tea and then we can like fantasize about the places where we would like to go Ooh, i'm also burning some incense when incense incense which i got as a gift uh when i was in india for diwali and i also got this as a gift i love ganesh so that's why i kept it and uh it, it was just a really special memory of diwali in india now for our travel fantasies where would you like to go me personally i would love to go to canada next year i would really really love to see some more nature in canada i would also like to see a lot more of the uk so i've only been to london up until now and i would love to see a lot more of like the other places in the uk oh i would also love 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 to go back to thailand um, to the fortune teller in Bangkok because she was so right everything that she predicted came true and uh, yeah I would like to go back and to hear more um, I would like to go back to Bali I was re-watching my travel vlogs from 2015 and Bali was was the first country well Bali the first country wow Ivana what are you talking about Indonesia was the first country I visited and I would love to see more of Indonesia but specifically I was watching those vlogs and I would love to spend a month in Bali again. So maybe that's what we will be doing again. I would like to see more of South America, but ooh, how about America? Will 2017 be the year I see America for the first time? Because I've never been to America. 
never ever and i would love to go i always love those vlogs from miami and la yeah that's my uh, little travel wish list for 2017 but maybe it will change you never know you never know and i'm already very very grateful for the travel that we've been doing this year so yeah i don't know i feel like a happy blessed human being and i hope you feel the same way because you're always traveling with me, baby. By the way, did I ever tell you one of my favorite things, and I was actually doing it yesterday, one of my favorite things is to just check Skyscanner, and let's do it together now, just randomly. Let me see. Um, and then check like flight tickets for anywhere in the world. I would love that. So yeah, let me know down in the comments below what places you would like to go. And uh, maybe we can um, we can visualize together and stuff like that. People say it doesn't work. Who cares? If it makes you happier, it doesn't hurt you, right? I don't know. I got Skyscanner here. It's my favorite booking site. And they got this option that you can choose anywhere in the world. And then we search. This is so much funny. Oh, I would like to go to Jordan too. But I don't know. What do we have here? Italy? Yes, maybe we can go to Italy. And Portugal is awesome as well. Oh, I would love to go to Serbia, man. I know this says Croatia, but I would love to go to Serbia too. And then what else do we have? Iceland. I don't know if I would like Iceland for 2017. I wouldn't say no, but um, there are other places I would rather go. This ticket is crazy cheap. 143 euros damn that's cheap man let me see let me see let me see <gasps> us less than 300 euros let's see where we can go to the us canada 313 euros what what we can go to new york for less than 300 euros what we can go to orlando florida <gasps> oh my gosh Okay, for real? We can go to LA for less than 350 euros. Miami, less than 350 euros. Okay, we need to discuss something because um, I already had some campaigns and are, there are some coming up. And it's crazy, the idea of getting paid to travel or to visit a destination, but so therefore i'm not really counting on it as an income but it would be great if it happens more in uh, 2017 but if it's enough to pay for a trip to the us like i think this is going to be the most massive bucket list item for 2017 we should go to the us yeah we should really go to the us that would be fun to be very honest like this might sound really greedy but all the money that i'm earning like from youtube income which is not a lot at all don't don't even think about it it's not worth it if you want to do this as a career to make money don't do it i for me travel is the most important thing but all the money that i'm earning with travel vlogging i put it right back into new travel so right now i booked the tickets to spain so if we make enough money to go to the US, we will be going to the US in 2017. Okay, and now it's time to put words into action, work, 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 because I need to edit videos and then we also need to do groceries. So let's do this. It is 6 p.m. I just showered, made myself a little bit decent and we're going to get some food because we need some numb in this kitchen. Well, that was an epic fail. I was so um, busy doing the actual groceries, I forgot to vlog them. So I will give you a peep in the groceries, but first I gotta carry them upstairs because Stefan is not home. He's playing tennis with his brother. Uh, let me just carry this and then I will show you. what's well, actually the usual groceries, but oh, no, I got some little things. So I'm gonna show you. buckwheat pasta again it's really good i like it and then we have some pecan nuts roasted almonds love it love it love it oh i got this melon 
I have no idea if it's yellow or orange in the inside, but um, I saw a vegan vlogger eating it and I was like, oh, I'm feeling some melon. I want it, I want it. Oh, and I got some grapefruits too because Avita taught me how to eat grapefruits. What else did I get? Mmm, Turkish yogurt, my favorite. This is gonna be dinner, a salad, and I'm just going to add some soy sauce. Just like this. Hashtag forever lazy. I have lettuce in there, I have some cucumbers over here, some tomatoes, some fresh tomatoes, uh, some fake chicken, which I think is going, I don't know. Sometimes it tastes too real for me and I don't like it. I don't like the taste of chicken. So why do you buy fake chicken, Ivana? Well, I don't know, protein, I don't know. You have to uh, eat new things and try new things and yada yada yada. Anyways, also some lentils, uh, some sheep cheese, and oh, wait, wait. I want to add some, I think we're going to add some apple vinegar. This jar, it's just... <sighs> okay, so adding, oh, I think that's already too much. Just a little bit of the vinegar. Right now I have 15 minutes to have dinner, to eat this wonderful salad, because then I have like a YouTube workshop uh, online. And um, after that, I have to work too. So you think I only take naps? No, I don't, no, I don't. I actually get some work done, but my working hours are very different than traditional office hours. Like I usually start at maybe one or something and then I work until nine. And I really like that. The YouTube Hangout lasted longer than expected, so I just watched a couple of vlogs and now it's 9 p.m. so Project Sleep is into action. I brush my teeth and I have my chamomile tea over her. Also, I'm going to attempt something very ambitious. Reading Anna Karenina. It is <laughs> so difficult. It is uh, in English, so it's good for my English. But also, like, there are so freaking many characters. It's it's crazy, so I'm going to try to read this book, but I know it's going to take me a long, long time to finish it. But, you know, if you don't take the first step, you will never reach your goal or end destination or whatever. Anyway. <laughs> If you're not yet subscribed to my channel, click that subscribe button because then you can travel along to Germany, London, Spain for sure and maybe like a long overseas trip, you never know. If you like the vlog, put a thumbs up and thank you so much for watching. I will see you next time. Bye!